Okay, let's go ahead and good luck, Mr. BMX here. We do have the Blood Whip out, so it's going to be interesting to see how it matches up with some of these other items, like his weapon and all that kind of shit. Like, I could be using the same pet he has out, but I don't want to be a prod just about. Okay, ooh, let's go, baby. Got his ass with the combo. He did not see that shit coming. Thanks for the Dragon Hosta, my friend, and for the money. Good luck to the target, Mr. Max Hits, and since we are testing out the new Blood Whip, I thought it was gonna be only right to use only blood armor, but since there's no blood top and bottom that's melee, basically, we're just gonna be using Dragon, which has little to no defense, so you guys can't complain and say that it's overpowered, highly defensive, and etc, etc. He's gonna Ballista here. Shit, I did save quite a bit, but I am basically wearing no armor. And I mean, even though I saved, as you guys saw, he almost killed me. If he hit high enough, he would have had a chance to kill me, but... DDS go? I mean, g Maul, let me down. As well, only reason I'm using the Blood Hydra, because it is a blood monster, but I might end up switching it since it is kind of dog shit. Okay, 50, come on. 54 for the KO isn't the way I wanted him to go down, but it took his ass down, so we're going to take it. All right, good luck to this guy. Amen. 90, 69.8. Let's hope we have a chance. I don't know how this guy's hitting me more with his regular whip compared to my blood whip. I fail to understand that logic. Isn't this whip supposed to be meta and really good? I'm hitting complete dog shit right now. Come on, Ryan. And like I always say, when I'm fighting a new guy, I'm not going to keep my hit points like I do everybody else. Max, he has just an AGS to Gmo. Oh, he has some claws. Ooh, and surprisingly, they hit really damn hard. And he has the Chaotic Maul. Dude, that new guy RNG is fucking crazy. Dude. Hit me, hit me. Come on, bro. What's going on? There it is. I was like scuffed as kill, but his character was going all over the place, which is why I decided to just go with it. But uh, good fight to him. Good luck to Mr. Too Lazy, whatever his in game name is. He does have the Blood Whip as well. So it's going to be an interesting one here. No, don't do it. There it is, bro. That's what I was looking for. Fakey the fucking whip into the AGS with the combination of the vengeance. He did not stand a damn chance. Look to Mr. High Life. Let's hope he does not skip us. Oh, uh, what a bitch. Good luck to Mr. Binky at YXO. He hit me back, so if he runs out, I'm just going to spec-tab him. Watch this combo, guys. I'm not talking about his. I'm talking about mine, homie. Good golly. Okay, okay. Then I should have just g mauled him if I knew he was that low of hit points. Let's go! Give me that motherfucking kill, G! And he had a ballista? God damn. Alright guys, I hope you guys are enjoying the video so far. We are going to announce the $100 giveaway winner from this loot from 1500 Skatizo kills. And it looks like there was 111 of you guys that did join this giveaway. So also guys, for this next video, I do want to set a goal. If we could get 150 likes next video, I'll host a $300 giveaway on the following video. So with that being said, guys, this is my Discord here. If you do win this $100 bond, um, you know how to contact me so we can meet up and I can give you your money. So let's go ahead and continue and let's congratulate the winner of the $100 bond. 
Congratulations to Mr. Slayerman777. I hope you guys are enjoying the video so far and that you continue to enjoy it. Okay, okay. Ooh, the 70, bro. I risked it for him, but you know what I'm saying? It's the least we could do. Looks like he misclicked his special attack there, but it is what it is. We do have to kill this guy before he gets a teleport. Seventy-one for the KO. Good fight. It was pretty scuffed, but you know I did what I had to do. Got the kill and made like two, like made like five bill because these are like four bill currently. Bill to Mr. Folkoff. I will not make this guy skull since he does look like somewhat of a new player. With that being said, guys, I know you guys know I tend to risk the HP a little bit when I'm finding a new player. It's so like right here, I'd eat. I'll eat right here too. Okay, he is 75 isn't too bad. Ooh, the 56 for the KO. Good fight, brother. Good luck to this dude right here. Good luck, good luck. Hopefully we can smite one of these things, even though I'm not in a smite setup. But, I mean, there's always that chance that somebody can get smited. Alright, alright, it was his turn to spec. So, I mean, he, he had a good chance to kill me there. I'm not gonna lie and say he didn't chance me, because he did. But, okay, I broke his vengeance and I didn't hit so hard on him. Come on, bro, hit something. Have a fucking AGS or for crying out loud. Five seconds and I have another spec, so. Alright, this is the only chance I have left, guys. Ooh, good fight, bro. I had to risk that, honestly. I had to do it. All right, good luck to Mr. Marco here. He says he's not sculling. The Elder Maul. Oh, I see why now. He has an Elder Maul. With the claws and shit like that, so. He should be dead here, honestly. Good fight, brother. And that's another reason why I know he didn't skull. I'm not gonna say it, though. Let's see if Mr. Valaxiana, Valanxia, whatever the fuck his name is. Let's see if he has more luck to try and kill me this time so he can get his revenge. With a 53, I could have died there. I'm not going to lie because I hit so hard on his vengeance. But he hit a zero, so... Damn, a 63 whack. The max is... A, and he died to my vengeance. <laughs> he just drops the LOL. 
I was gonna say the max I believe is a 67. 